Our third principle for assessment for learning is to give students opportunities to reflect on their own learning. We don't want students to only take a test and forget about it and forget all the information they learned. Instead, we want them to look at their results from the assessment and think about what they did well and how they could do better. This is reflective learning. You can help students do this by asking them to write two or three things they want to learn at the beginning of each unit. Then at the end of the unit, after an assessment, ask them to reflect on if they met their goals. They can write the reflection and turn it into you, or they can share their reflections in small group discussion during class. Be sure to do this several times during the semester so that students become more skilled at doing these reflections. Student goals should be specific. For example, if your field has a specific test they will need to pass in order to become certified, their goal might be to learn the information required in order to pass that test. You can also ask students to help each other by giving feedback to each other so that everyone learns more. This is often called peer review or peer assessment. It doesn't mean that students grade each other. It means they look at each other's work, such as a paper or presentation, and offer suggestions on how to make it better. Then they can make any revisions before they turn in their work to the instructor, and it is graded. Here's a quote from a student in Moore's study about peer assessment. I realize that peer assessment is kind of a student's job. It's a whole class activity. The value of peer assessment is, for me, I can see other people's mistakes, and I can learn from that. As you see, when students help each other, they learn from each other as well. Remember that when a student tries very hard to do well on an assessment, and that student fails or does poorly, this can be very demotivating, causing them to not want to try harder in the future. The more we can involve students in their learning and create fair assessments, the greater chance there is that they will feel empowered to succeed.